Okay, so the application process is last year, actually, in the beginning of the year, um, so it was like, I don't know, September, um, I applied, and you take it to the, your application to the sixth floor of the union, and then after that, um, in early December, I got an acceptance email saying I was um, going to be in the first May semester, um, which is obviously in May. So then in, I think it was spring, we had a meeting with like where our family came and everything. We got a really big packet and had to fill out all different medical forms and all the different forms, you know, like your passport and everything. Um, and then on May 2nd, we all met at um, the airport and all got on a plane together to Italy. Uh, actually, uh, my university and Duking, uh, they have a lot of connection with, with each other. So uh, our home school uh, offered some opportunities for us to go abroad to study for one semester. And, and if we decide to uh, take, the, uh, take the program, uh, first we have to pass uh, the English test. It is called uh, TOEFL or ELSE. But I am really surprised uh, that most of the Americans, they don't know this English test. But everyone from China or from Asia, if they want to go to America, they have to uh, take, they have to pass this uh, English test. And then if you pass the test, the school will uh, help us to apply for, uh, for some of the schools. Most of the procedures are, uh, we have to uh, offer our grades, and if the king thinks uh, it is okay, and they will give us our I twenty, then then we can come, and and later we have to have our visa successfully. And the program lasted four weeks, so you only had eight classes while you were there, and you still got six credits. And then obviously, when you're in Italy, you want to travel and explore. You don't really want to, I don't know, sit in your room and study, but overall I thought it was an amazing experience. And firstly, when I, when I came here and I felt really warm because uh, the people in per Pittsburgh is, are really, really nice and everyone uh, is willing to help us. Uh, and so I feel really good here. Um, whoever you're going with to take an Italian course, like a 101 um, course, because then you can get to know everyone you're going with and also learn some Italian, so it's a lot easier to communicate and navigate um, around the city. But, yeah, we didn't have to know or any words in Italian. But once you're there, you definitely pick it up because you're so immersed into the culture and really to get around and everything, you have to, you pick up words, phrases, which is really cool because now I know a little bit, little bit of Italian. Ciao, Bella! <laughs>